Alright, yeah, welcome back to some more in World Alpha 17. So, what are we going to do in today's episode? Well, we currently are struggling a little bit with food. Only a little bit. We've got two muffalo corpses that are currently frozen and ready to butcher at a moment's notice. We do need a little bit of wood, though, because apparently our stove is out. And um, we've been deconstructing part of the... Uh, houses in order to do that because the wood around this area is a little bit lackluster to be completely honest so I mean we could set up possible orders oh yeah and also triggers out in the middle of nowhere mental breaking so yeah you can see we've got absolutely bugger all as far as trees are concerned in fact there aren't any trees that we can chop down which makes this a problem. Uh, that's Trigger's room. Have we not built a new room for Trigger? Okay, we can do that then. Uh, we can make it out of marble. And match it up. There we go. I think these have been made out of steel, aren't they? Yeah. Well, we've got some uh, very odd coloration in our buildings, but... We're not in a, uh, a position for having nice things, really. Set that squirrel to hunt. Oh, Trigger's just passed out. Get up and go to bed. There you go. Problem solved. Uh, we are going to start having to put some... Um, uh, there was some jiggers heating stuff in there at some point. Uh, we do need to make some parkers, though. So, let's have a look at what we need to do. We need Parker for you, Parker for you. Yours is not a dead man's, but it is going to be rotten. So, we need three. Yours is fine. You don't have one, so that's four. And yours is fine. So, make four Parkers. Out of whatever we can. Uh, you need some trousers. You need some pants. You need some pants. You need some pants. That's four. You're probably going to need some. Five. And you might as well have some. Six pants. We should have all of the materials required for this as well. Because we've got 848 muffalo leather. 557 caribou leather. We can at least make a good dent in all of that. And then if we're making pants, then you need a shirt. You need a shirt. You need a shirt. Yours is probably worth getting for... Yours is fine. It's at 69%. Can't be any better. Okay, four. Let's get uh, some shirts then. Button down shirt, I guess. I think it was four that we wanted. And we'll get ordered to make all of that stuff. Uh, Gregor, do you want to do the hauling? Uh, the tailoring, sorry. Six. Oh, Sadja could do it. Sadja does too much already, but yeah, we'll uh, we'll get Gregor working on that stuff. Uh, Hunter needs a weapon trigger. Okay. We can uh, give you that pistol in a second. Normal at nineteen, poor at hundred. All right. Well, we'll go for the poor quality one. That's one hundred percent. Really need to start deconstructing people's walls as well for the wood. So let's start doing that. Salona failed. Hmm. Salona failed again. Stop it, Salona. Stop failing. So, do these grow? Not ideal temperature. Balls. Oh, no. We've got a growth. So they do sort of grow. So O'Connell should now be, yep, refueling the stove. And now that that's done, we can replace all of that with marble. 
And Trigger can live in here now. Uh, that looks unroofed. Thank you. Fixed. Trigger can live in there. We could get some vents in as well. So that we can heat up these rooms if, um, with just a single fire each. Because we are going to need to save wood. I need traders to come by with wood. It's what we really need. That's how we get ourselves out of this mess. Because these are growing at like 10% the rate. Which is atrocious. Right, anyway. Uh, trigger. Hauling stuff. Go for it. And then you can take the poor quality 100% pistol. There you go. Actually, we wanted to give you the light machine gun, didn't we? Who's got the light machine guns? Uh, Gregor's got one. Somebody else has one, right? You're normal at 23. Hmm. Shooting nine to Gregor's shooting four. Okay, uh, Gregor, you drop yours. Trigger, drop the pistol. Pick up the LMG, and then Gregor can have the pistol. There we go. Now Trigger hunts with a light machine gun, and he can spread his damage across the world, as it were. Uh, Thelona, before you go to bed, why don't you finish your wall so you're not outside? <laughs> you know, people like to sleep indoors and all that. And not share rooms. And that's, uh, ah, oh, we've almost run out of fuel already. This is not a permanent solution by any stretch. Thelona, why are you so bad at constructing? You're a seven. You failed three times in a row. Come on. One bit of wall. One bit of wall and you can go to bed. There you go. Problem solved. Hmm. I might try, um, add another zone for more trees. Maybe try a different tree. Maybe the growing temperature on it is different. I doubt it. I think they all grow at the same temperature, really. Fertility requirement. Fertility sensitivity. Might be something to do with the, um, the temperature that it grows in, perhaps. Growing time, 20 days. Lifespan. Like, requirement. It's not necessarily uh, important, that one. Okay. So, are they all fertility sensitive to 50%? Yeah, okay. Growing time, we want the, the quickest growing time then, don't we? 14 for the Cecropia. 32 for that one. Birch, 20. Pine, 20. Poplar, 15. Okay. And oak, 30. So it's between the Cecropia and the Poplar. We'll go with the Cecropia. Why not? Actually, the Poplar looks like it'll fit in more. Go with that. If anybody wants to sow that, they can absolutely go ahead and do that. Temperature requirements is a little bit annoying though. Because I don't think they're actually going to grow, but might as well try and plant them nonetheless. Did we got idle colonists or no oh, you're cleaning? Yeah, we don't want you doing that. Is that the first Parker? I think it is, you know. Yeah. Okay, um, in that case, let's get doing some more deadfall traps. Some more just randomly spread ones, I think. Let's 
Something like that. It's a lot of jobs to do, of course, but... Jobs need doing. And then I can order some mining as well while we're at it. Because we did just barely survive uh, the previous raid, so... Add some more deadfall traps in to fix that problem. Uh, we want to get rid of those steel slag chunks as well. Ooh. You're moving into murder range, so we'll take you out. Yeah, I regret the day you ever came into our base, won't you? Silly little caribou. Yeah, we might as well take that cloth. It's just degrading over there. Somebody can move it. Uh, O'Connell's been attacked by an arctic wolf. Oh, for God's sake, Blue. Melee attack. O'Connell, fight back. Trigger. Head up. Fire at it, please. Blue's going to be the one to beat it. There we go. Okay. Actually, Blue, you beat it to death. O'Connell, you just go get medical attention. Because you've lost a toe. Oh, boy. I don't understand how we're still alive in this run. <laughs> I really don't. It's going so badly. We got no medicine. We've got no real defenses that I'm confident and happy with. Currently researching electricity. We've got barely any food. We've got an inability to grow and one of the resources we need most, we can't use. I suppose that would be an excuse to force electricity to be researched. Uh, where am I going? Work. Brain fart there. Uh, let's get somebody working on it then. Gregor, hmm. you are our best researcher, so maybe I'll get Sadger on the tailoring instead then. Let's cancel that, because you won't finish it in time. Anybody tended to you yet? Nope. Okay, I hate this colony officially. Tend to O'Connell. Thank you. Yeah, it doesn't matter that he's bleeding out and, you know, he's... Oh my god, dying because of the cold. Uh, orders, harvest. There's nothing to harvest. Anything that dies will continue to die. Solar flare will cut down all of our stuff that we don't have. And deadly. How have you uh, survived this long? Maybe because we think you're deadly. Daily time because of the cold? Oh, is it that cold in there? Bugger. Another reason to research electricity quicker. Sadra, are you doing anything over... Uh, sorry, Gregor, are you doing anything over... That sort of stuff. There we go. Hmm. There we go. Now we should be doing it as a number one priority. After praying. Low food. We've got 149 meat and 68 vegetables. Thelona's making artwork. I'm sure there's something more important that Thelona can be doing. Cooking, constructing. We can destroy the rest of the wood, I guess. Is what we can do. We'll get rid of that wall up first, because O'Connell is currently freezing in his own room. Yeah, 
just... As I mentioned a few episodes ago, that toxic fallout is probably what's going to kill us. Because it stopped the pine trees from growing, which we'd have had a harvest by now. If it wasn't for that fallout, we'd have had all of this probably in our stockpiles currently frozen because of the temperature. But the fallout was just so badly timed that it's pretty much just killed all of our production for the year. And I don't know if we can get through the year with no production. Should be, um, you've got a shoddy bed. Oh. Need to make you a normal bed and put it in here then. Apparently. Can you build the bed first with the steel? I want to get trigger in one of these rooms. Good quality, wonderful. Right. Uh, deconstruct that, we get some wood back, and then this becomes trigger's bed. And we will reinstall it. There. This can still become a prisoner room. We can just put a... Um, Side to constructing, fair enough. Uh, we can just put a sleeping spot in here, or worst case scenario. Or we could just steal bed it later on. So, that's going to be completely fine. As far as butcher's tables are concerned, can we... We can make them out of steel. Caravan request. Not much to do with that. We can get back materials from all of this wooden stuff. If we need it. Something to consider. But yeah, we really do need to be on electricity. We need just like a solar generator just to power up our stove so that we've got power around the, around the clock. And maybe a heater in all of them. That's pretty much all we need as far as electricity is concerned, which is why I'm going to force Gregor to work on it around the clock. Because if we can get that going, then... Wood stops becoming an issue, and temperature, by the same token, also stops becoming an issue. Uh, Thelona is working on that. Okay. Can you deconstruct the wall, in fact? Because somebody can refuel the stove once you've done that. Deconstruct that, deconstruct that. go. Keep going. Hmm. We occasionally get four back for some of that, which is interesting. But that is the last of our wooden walls, though. Oops. A bit there as well. So we got plenty of stone. And now Thelona can make some meals so we can eat normally. Which is pretty good. Some break risks there, apparently. Oh, and all of our crops are now dead. Bad seasonal temperature, so nobody's going to grow anymore. I don't know if any of these are going to uh, continue growing. I doubt it. I don't think they'll ever become an opportunity for that. But we need to hunt again. So the caribou down south are there, but I'd rather not go all the way around to go get them. There's one here and one there. Okay, we'll order these to be hunted. They'll be worth our time. I think it's about to start snowing. Alright, fair enough. I don't know why you need cover to hunt this har caribou, but whatever. LMG is just so good. 
Oh dear. They'll prepare for a while before they attack. Alright, well. Uh, finish this off. I'm not even gonna look at that. <laughs> at those guys, because I imagine it's horrible. You know what? It's time. Let's have a look. Oh boy. That is... Okay. That's okay. We've got... 13 steel, so we can't make any more traps. Set them to auto rearm. A lot of those guys look like melee units to me. Peelers, ranged. Steel spear, steel club. Great bow, great bow, great bow. Sandstone club. It's about 50 50. 50 50 is good though, because that means that half of them are going to get clogged up on the front of our kill box. Which is really nice. So we probably survive this. Here they go. Alright. Ladies and gents, let's get up and let's fight these guys. Alright, everybody's got a weapon. Draft them up front. We want the LMGs to be able to fire directly down the line. We want blue, our melee unit, to block the closest point. The loner, our rifleman, to go there. Gregor, go there. Actually, Gregor, you go there and block. I want the uh, automatic rifles to be the ones that continue firing when they uh, close the distance. Here we go. Just because this is a great chance of hitting a lot of stuff. So. They are coming through. Can I block them? Didn't manage to block all of them. Can block you though. Fire there. Blue. Come down here and melee attack there. The rest of you, I think you've got your orders appropriately lined up. Blue, come back this way. Trigger. Fire at Menino. Oh, never mind. Gregor, who are you shooting at now? So it looks like you're on teammates. Blue, melee tap Menino. Colony seems rescued. Oh, Connell has gone down. We are taking a lot of hits here. And they're fleeing. Okay. Beautiful. Okay. That's uh, a lot of people that have just been downed that are not dead, so I can take their clothing. Let's have a quick look at the injury report. We've got a couple of stabs, dead in 11 hours. Pretty much nothing wrong with you. Pretty much nothing wrong with you. You are in an atrocious amount of pain, O'Connell. You are probably going to die, if I'm honest. Uh, so now you're missing arms. Lots of damage to a lot of limbs. So, let's make sure that O'Connell is being picked up by somebody who's in no immediate danger. You can rescue him. Sanjar, I want you to strip the living of their possessions. Area Parker, nice. Because I want their Parkers essentially. It's very important that we've got warm clothing. And then Felona can do the doctoring while Sadger does the hauling of this stuff. I think, anyway. I don't know. Felona needs tending to. So, O'Connell, ten, uh, ten, 10 to O'Connell. A bulk goods trade is arriving. Hopefully they're going to sell us wood. That'd be great. Let me get some more medical beds set up just to increase the heal rate. In fact, most people should have medical beds for that reason.
Sadger, 10 to blue. Local caribou's gone mad. It's alright, it's probably going to attack Kamoa. Uh, faction relation minus 5. Oh, okay. Uh, are you guys coming in? You are coming in. Okay. Sadja tend to Thelona. Sadja's having a mental break. Okay. Uh, Thelona, tend to yourself. Apologies, guys. I left my window open. Whoa, 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 whoa. What the actual hell? What? Just happened there. Salona. Actually, we're going to have to do like Gregor. Uh, who's the trader here? Don't leave. Let me check these these guys, the uh the muffalo. Well they didn't have any wood. By the looks of things. So I'm not too upset about that. Although that really does suck that they're leaving. Why leave? Why? I don't even know what the hell happened there. To be honest. Uh, right. Still more stuff to tend to. A few more people in no immediate danger. Come on. Ah, blue's fully healed. Alright, Gregor's tending now. So that's good. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. Gregor, self tend. You're fine ish. I mean, hmm. moving needs sorting. We need wood in order to make you a peg leg. So you can see the issue. Sadger. Serious hypothermia. Uh, somebody needs to arrest Sadja. Get him inside. Uh, Blue, you can do it. And we're going to have to arrest Sadja. How are you guys doing? Don't even want to know. But... We're going to end it here anyway, guys. So if you have enjoyed the content and you want to see more, then be sure to like and subscribe. Not sure how much longer this run's going to go, but I Im imagine it's going to uh, end relatively soon. Just by the sheer horrendous luck we've been having. Um, could you put down your Parker, please, Blue? And then force wear that one. And then there's the, uh, the sign. Yep, clear forced. There we go. Just so that when Sadger gets up, because he's not currently one of ours. 70% recruitment difficulty. Jesus. Well, Thelona, I'm going to need your help here. Because Sadger is a major part of this group. So I'm going to need you to get him back into the team. Also, somebody needs to hunt that stuff. Anyway, guys, like and subscribe. And if you want to hit that bell icon as well, you'll get some notifications when I release new videos. I do hope you've enjoyed, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.